Good morning students. Students, today we are going to learn how to read the time in the intervals of 5 minutes. So, let's start. Students, one day Ram and Kiran were talking to each other. Ram asked Kiran, How much time do you take to reach the school from home? Kiran said, I take 10 minutes to reach school on foot from my house. But Ram said, I take only 4 minutes to reach school from my house. Kiran said, It is impossible because your house is farther than mine from school. Ram said, I have noted time in my watch. I start for a school at 7 a.m. and reach there when minute hand is on 4. So, it means 7, 4 a.m. But Kiran said, Ram, you are wrong. Have you noticed small rhymes between numbers? Ram said, yes. Kiran said, there are 20 lines from 12 to 4. So, it is 7.20 a.m. Not 7.4 a.m. So, you reach at school 20 minutes past 7. Means 7.20 a.m. And so, you take 20 minutes to reach school. Students, now we read the time in the intervals of 5 minutes. Students, our hand is on 7 and minute hand is on 12. So, it is 7 o'clock. Now, students, when minute hand is moved to number 1, the time is 5 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is moved to number 2, the time is 10 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 3, the time is 15 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is moved to number 4, the time is 20 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 5, the time is 25 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 6, the time is 30 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 7, the time is 35 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 8, the time is 40 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 9, the time is 45 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 10, the time is 50 minutes past 7. When the minute hand is on number 11, the time is 55 minutes past 7. Students, this is the model of clock. You have also prepared this model in your home. Cut the paper into circular shape and paste it on cardboard. Then write 1 to 12 numbers. Now students see on number 1, 5 minutes. On number 2, 10 minutes. On number 3, 15 minutes. Number 4, 20 minutes. So on, you write the table of 5 and read the time in the intervals of 5 minutes. Students, now we will solve first sum of exercise 6.1. Write the time shown in each clock given below. Now we discuss its first part. Students, see in this clock, the hour hand is on number 7 and the minute hand is on number 2. Now students, see the time. The time is 10 minutes past 7. So, we write it as 7.10 or 10 minutes past 7. Now, we discuss its another part. Students, in this clock, the hour hand is on number 1. And the minute hand is on number 11. So, let's see the time. 
the time is 55 minutes past 1. We write it as 1.55 or 55 minutes past 1. Students, now we discuss one question later to pass. Tell the time shown on given clock. In this, four options are given and we have to choose the correct option. Students, see the clock. The hour hand is on number 10 and the minute hand is on number 2. So, the time is 10 minutes past 10. So, the correct option is C. Put a tick on option C. Now, it's time for homework. In your homework, you have to read the time in the intervals of 5 minutes and also solve the first sum of exercise 6.1. Thank you.